guys it's kimberly here combos with kim and i'm back with another message for you guys happy sunday happy father's day happy juneteenth um it's a lot to celebrate this weekend and i won't be before you long i just wanted to share something with you guys um something that came on my heart this morning and just a word of encouragement, honestly, for those of you that have been chosen and that have been given, you know, specific assignments in your life. And those of you that have been set apart by God um, to pursue your purpose and to pursue the calling of just whatever, however that looks um, in this world, know that people will try to um people will try to mislead you people will try to attack it attack what it is that god has told you um the enemy will use people close to you will use friends will use family to try to misconstrue something that god has already authorized and already confirmed um because the enemy can see he doesn't know, he's not omnipresent, he's not omnipotent, but he knows that you have been chosen and set apart by God. So he is going to do everything in his power to try and get, to, to try and stop that from happening, even if it means using those that are closest to you, those who you would least expect. That's oftentimes who he used. So my word of encouragement is to just stay firm in your foundation, which is Christ, and just continue to pursue and persevere through whatever it is God has told you. Your your journey may not look like other people's. Other people's may not look like yours, but you have to um, trust God's plans. And even if that means having asking God, Lord, can you reaffirm what you have already told me? Can you reaffirm um, and just help me to remember the promises you've given me and the assignment you have uh, you have given me? Just if you need that reassurance, whatever it is, ask God for it. He will give it to you. But just know that. Um, you know, he hasn't, he will not lead you somewhere to forsake you. He would not reveal something or put a desire in your heart and then not allow it to come to pass. Def, just stay encouraged um, and seek God always when things, you know, if this, the circumstance does happen where you notice people around you are doubting you, are trying to um, change what God has already told you or um, interfere because I mean they can't change it if God God has already authorized it but those that try to persuade you to do otherwise seek God like he he can help you he will be able to get you through it and talk to those that have been encouraging and have been affirming even more even more um you know affirming what God has has placed on your heart and those who you trust those who you trust with what God has told you because you can't you know, truth of the matter, you can't trust everybody with um, what God has revealed to you. You have to be very selective about what you share and who you share it with. Um, so yeah, that's all I really have for today. It was on my heart to share this message and uh, stay encouraged and um, understand that all of us, we all have a purpose and things happen, obstacles come People try to interfere with that purpose, but you have to stand your ground. You have to be rooted in God and know that um, he sees you fit for whatever it is that he has called you to do. So he would not send you somewhere. He will not place a desire in your heart if he didn't see you fit to do it in the first place. So thank you guys um, for watching and I will see you in the next video.